if you're curious on how I got this gold like effect on this painting, keep watching this video to get more details about it. Thank you. But first, I got to self promote. I am a self taught artist that sells prints on the side. If anything catches your eye, everything is linked in the description. Well, hello to my new subscribers and hello to the new people that's watching this video and other ones, hopefully. First thing that you're gonna need is some water. And after that, you're gonna need some um, adhesive. This one I got from Hobby Lobby. I will link it in the description down below. Lastly, you're gonna need a napkin, a style from brush, and of course, some gold leaf. So right here at this step, you're gonna to want to gently dip in your brush into the adhesive right here. Not too much now, not too much. Even if you do um, get too much, which I think I did, either either you can scrape it on the napkin or right here, I just put it on the concrete because that's the most convenient thing for me right now, as y'all can see. Also, get you a raggedy looking brush, a cheap brush, a brush that's not your favorite, and that's not expensive because the glue sometimes can um, damage the, um, the bristles and I don't wanna hear any of my crying or nothing. So giving you a big old heads up, okay? Now that the glue is on my brush, I'm just gently applying the adhesive on the spots where I want the gold leaf to be looking all nice and shiny at. And so as you can see right here, this is the full view of the painting. As you can see, there's already gold leaf already on this painting. All I'm doing is just revamping this one because she gonna be presented in, a, in her first art gallery, which is black owned by the way. So I am super, super excited. I most likely will put a video or a picture towards the end so you can see how lovely and beautiful she, she was looking at the, at the art gallery. After you have finished applying your glue, go ahead and put that paintbrush into the water so that it does not damage your bristles. Like I said, I wanna hear nobody crying, okay? Okay, so as you can see right here, I went ahead and this is the up close view of me after I applied the adhesive, as you can see right there that one we got that one and what else we got and we got okay that one that one and we got that one too now to see if the gold leaf is ready to be applied you want to go ahead and use the back of the knuckle to see if you have this like this like sticky feeling on the back of it i want to say you should be able to hear it like it should it should feel tacky and you should hear like a like a sticky noise so hold on Yep, you see how, yep. Boom, there it is on that one. This one is still kind of a little bit soft, but it's, it's sticky. And this one, beautiful. Tap, tap. Now the part everybody has been waiting for, how to apply the gold leaf. But before I go into full detail, go ahead and hit that like button for me real quick. You won't lose any money. You won't go bald. Go ahead and hit it for me real quick. Thank you so much. Now, with applying um, the gold leaf, you want to do it outside because this shit gets everywhere. Like it will, it's like glitter. This, it will stay in your house for months. Not even kidding. And you also want to be like very, very gentle with it because one tap, this thing is breaking off in pieces. Like you want, you want to be so gentle with it, like you care for a newborn baby. Maybe a little, little bit dramatic but it is just that fragile. If you're unsure where to find gold leaf at, either you can find it at Michael's Hobby Lobby. But I got mine from, um, from eBay. It's way cheaper, but it takes like two weeks to a month to get here. But I don't be in no type of hurry. So right here, I'm just patting, patting, pat, pat the, the gold leaf on where the adhesive was at. As you can see, I'm having a little bit of trouble, trouble because the glue so you'll make sure that the adhesive is a little bit more tacky. If not, it's gonna stick to your, your styrofoam um, brush. But yeah, right here, tap, 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 beautiful. Don't worry, I will do a more so closer up um, shot so you can um, see how I did it. So after I tapped them over here, just scraping off the excess foil. Beautiful, beautiful. And be nice with me with how I am working the camera because I'm over here trying to record and tap off this excess foil. So please be patient with me, okay? Here's a better view of how I have tapped this. I'm over here using some excess um, gold leaf and I am patting it, pat, pat, pat. Oh, actually, no, I'm not, I am scraping it, I'm scraping it. So it's, this is a different technique, but as you can see, 
with me scraping it i'm not getting the full capacity compared to me pat patting it you, you like you see the difference right here this one is more opaque and more shiny to me it is that thing looking beautiful ain't it yes ma'am sorry about that but yeah um <laughs> there here's this one right here i'm getting the excess gold leaf again and i am tap this one right here i am tapping it and being very gentle with it like you don't have to use the full gold leaf um square you can just use like an edge of it at a time and right here that's what i'm doing and i'm in the scraping off the excess that thing looking nice yes Don't forget to put that paintbrush in the water y'all like i said earlier and this is the last step you want to get some spray sealer so that um the gold leaf can be lasting and shining for years to come i'll link all this information down below in the description where i get my adhesive my my gold leaf all that good stuff okay just spraying them making the all nice and shiny and make sure you give it a whole day for it to dry because um it can um, be a little bit tacky and um, and sticky too. And finally, there's my baby looking all good and stuff. There she is, boom. And there I am looking all cute and stuff. Thank you so much for everybody who stayed this long and wait for the final results. You are very appreciated and you have a great day or night wherever you're watching this video at.